Hello, it's been a couple of weeks. I've been a bit busy. Sorry about that. But here we are, the RetroTech 120p arcade challenge. Now, I've missed about six, maybe seven challenges. Um, I started a new job. Things have been crazy. You know what it's like. So um, I thought today I've got some free time. So tonight I am going to go through all of the challenges I missed back to back to back to back. And we're going to start off with the current challenge, which is due for submission tomorrow, and that is for the Punisher. So the rules are simple. I've got two credits to get through as much of the game as I possibly can. Default settings. We're starting off with the Punisher, and then we're just going to roll through the night. We're going to go through all the games that I may have missed. Now, I haven't practiced any of these games. As I say, I've been quite busy. Uh, so, uh, so yeah, practice has been out the window. So, uh, or should I say, pew, out the window. But, let's go. Here we go. First game, off the blocks. Let's <laughs> begin. Okay, so. We are using uh, RetroArch today. For our emulation purposes. <laughs> I have no idea what he says there. But it matters not. Let's defeat the awfully wooden arcade machine over here. Get a thousand for my video game. And let's just destroy everything as we go along. So, uh, in this instance, it's as far as we can get, basically. It's distance based. That's what the challenge is. And the Punisher is a great little Capcom beat em up. Not one of the most popular. In, uh, in their back catalogue, but still very cool nonetheless. Awesome animation. And it's one of the few where you can actually pick up weapons as you go as well. Okay, bam. Okay. Made light work of them. See if we can make light work of light make light work of him. Smash through the bus. You're finished now, Bruno. Scully, get him. No, Scully. On second thoughts, leave me alone. How about that, eh? Or else I'm gonna have to kill all your friends. I'm gonna kill him anyway, but you don't know that yet. Everyone in the back of the bus, who the heck gets a battle axe? Where the heck do you get a battle axe from in modern day? It's not exactly battle axes or us around here. Scully is dead. Everyone's dead. They are brown bread. Yeah. Okay. Pick him up by his chest hair. Tell me where the boss is. Please don't kill me. He's at Castle Pantabear de Florida. Alright. Thanks and goodbye. <laughs> Shoot him anyway because we're a bastard. The only way to get into that castle would be via the drain pipe of the swimming pool. Well... Good job it wasn't the sewer pipe. Bruno won't escape me this time. Ooh, okay. I want your axe. Thank you very much. Do a bit of tree surgery. Where the hell are you? Okay. 
What the? What's going on? Okay, um... Had a slight PC glitch there, sorry about that. Mitsuki? Come on. Bye bye, bitch. There was a perfectly good door there. Thank you. Toasty! Oh, sorry, Kolsky, as it says there. Hammer time. King. Booyah. Okay. I don't die so easily. Time for justice. What the? Bruno? Lady Gaga. -ga -ga. I have been programmed by the Kingpin to terminate you. Oh, the backwards flash. It's so quick. Stick and move, stick and move. Get out of the way when he jumps, if at all possible. I have a question. Why was this robot in the bedroom? Hmm. And while I was pondering that, I have lost my first credit, so let's carry on. We're on my second and final credit. And he's just going to tear me apart, isn't he? Yeah, look at him. Come on. No! Come on. He's going down. There we go. It took all my lives to do it, but he is down. Kingpin. I knew he was behind all of this. There's a major drug deal going down at the harbour tonight. I've got my pocket money. Come on, get up, get up. Oh, I didn't want to do my special attack, but never mind. Got you right where I want you, Gus. On the end of my blade. Oh, he's a goalie. Oh. 
smoking. No. Well, there we go. That's the end of game number one. That is the Punisher. We got to the toasty guy in the truck. Which was terrible. That was awful. But it is the first of several games. So I do believe it was the Punisher, Double Dragon, Samurai Aces, King of the Fighters 98, Metamorphic Force, uh, Metal Slug, X and Rampage. I think those are all the games. So, we've got the first one out of the way. Let's just uh, navigate over to my stream. <laughs> diddly diddly deal, indeed. Alright, let's get the next one going. So, uh, let's do. Uh, Let's do metamorphic first force, should I say? Metamorphic force. So metamorphic force. Here we go. Now this is a four by three ratio game, so I will swap to my four by three ratio profile. There we go. So we're in four by three. Just gonna set up the controls. Actually, they should already be good to go. I'm just going to change the buttons. So we got one, two, three. Yeah, that'll do it. Two credits as far as we can go. Let's do this thing. All right, first, I'm going to make sure that the screen is nice and tidy. Proper bang tidy. Let's stretch that out. Move it into the middle. And let's go. So we got four characters to pick. I'm gonna go for this one. She's cross-eyed. But still very attractive. Fight! Okay, let's go. So it looks like my health tickles and trickles down with time. So I can't dilly dally. Cool music. Nice smooth animation. I think I've played this before, but I'm not entirely sure. Ah, oh, now we're morphing time. Cholesterol up. Fuck up. Knew that was gonna happen. my way man okay Shiny. 
Oh really? I just did. What you gonna do about it? Dead soon. On this level, though, poof, that's a rough way to go. Stage two. Damn, I'm gonna die very, very soon. Okay, kicked him in the balls on the way down. We're running out of health so badly, though. Yeah, there we go. Dead. Do we get... No, just one life per credit. Okay, uh, let's go... This guy. Get off me, man! God damn! Yeah, the animation on this is great. The gameplay, not quite as hot. You can see where the effort went into. Um, and it certainly looked unique amongst its peers, I guess, when it came out. But, yeah, it's not the best playing beat-em-up that you'll ever see. It's not bad, though. Definitely worth checking out, I think. Oh no, not a good time to turn back into a human, just to die. Okay, well I got up to flamey face, birdman, whatever it is. So flamey face, birdman, on metamorphic force, that's another game down. Okay, so... 
that is two games down, a couple more to go. We got to Flamey Birdie Bird. Let's move on to the next one. It's another beat em up. We're going to get all the beat em ups over and done with. So, this one is a classic. It's a granddaddy beat em up. It is Double Dragon. Now, we did have a couple of rules in this one. Um, there was a bit of back and forth about whether we should allow using elbows. Um, it was decided that, yeah, it's a legal move. We can use our bows in this game, uh, but I am not going to be using them very often because, well, I find it a bit boring just doing it over and over. But people could if they wanted to. That's not a problem whatsoever. So let's put in our two credits and let's see how we do. Oh, I forgot to change my buttons for the fighting mechanism, so let's see how we go anyway. Oh, okay. Hey there, buddy, you are an asshole. Hey there, buddy, you are an asshole. So come here and suck on my dick. Okay, my button layout is very awkward for this. This is not going to go well. So you could do that all the time. I'm, I'm not really going to be doing that much. Though I might have to to get rid of some enemies that are doing me dirty, like, like she is. A Bobo smash! Look at the slowdown. This is not an emulation problem. This is how the arcade version actually ran. It had horrendous slowdown problems, but it didn't stop Double Dragon from being an awesome game. For the time, anyway. It's, it's aged a bit, but what can you do? We all age a bit. Ah. I'm gonna die now, watch. See, the problem with the slowdown is, is that it slows down your button inputs. Now, Double Dragon has a headbutt feature where if you double tap a direction in quick succession, you fire a headbutt. But of course, when the game slows down, it slows down reading that input. So sometimes you can headbutt when you actually just want to move. And it's, it's quite difficult to actually gauge. I love this game. I'm not very good at it in this round, but I love it nonetheless. That's credit over already. Oh, this is not a good run at all. But no practice. Multiple games back to back. I'm not expecting, you know, S plus gameplay on every game. Ah. Or any game, to be honest. Ah, he got me. That's not good. No, oh, no, 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 no. Thank <laughs> you. 
No, that's really bad. I'm in the corner. No weapon. That could have gone a lot smoother. You notice I don't use kicks much in this. The kicks are far too too slow for my liking. Doom doom, ba doom doom. Have it, you slay egg. Hey there, buddy! Won't you suck on my gonads? Ah, they're just staying. Pixels out of range. There we go. Come on up. I'm ready for you. And again. Come on. There we go. I'm not going up the ladder. That is a death wish. Mm -hmm. Bam, bam. Come a bit closer and let you see my back now. Okay. No, I don't want to go up there. Mm -hmm. Just gonna edge because they're gonna come. There, you see them? There they are. They just stay pixels out of reach. No, don't go up the ladder. No, 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 no. That could be disastrous at this point. Anyone else want some? Gonna be slow, but it should work. I'm so glad that Double Dragon is now officially part of the Kunio-kun series. I love the Kunio-kuns. Oh no! But I don't love bouncing off loads of boxes. Okay. No, 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 no. This is bad. This is bad. This is very bad. Go on, lady. Off you go. Bye. Ooh. That's grating. This is the boss. Oh, it's like going through treacle. And you guys moan about 30 frames per second frame rates. This is what we dealt with and we liked it as a kid. Okay, okay I'm going to use the elbow on this guy. The slowdown is too much.
No! Ladies and gentlemen, one of the most overpowered moves in video game history. Okay, I am way behind how where I normally get to in this game. So I might have to cheap it out a little bit and just, just elbow my way through. Just to make sure I get a respectable distance. Speed. Unexpected speed boost. It's even more of a killer than the slowdown. Look. Oh, it's speeding up. It's going slowing down. It's all over the shop. But it's still awesome fun. Oh no, a ball ball. Oh no. Yeesh. Screw you, lady. Screw you, buddy. Ah. Extra life. Perfect. Because I just lost the other one. Great. in the hole. In that hole you go. Alright. Oh no, it's a bobo. I'm going to die right here, right now. The dreaded bridge. Huh. 
and that's why it's dreaded because a bobo knocks you either into the water or just kills you outright. And there we are, that's another one down. So Double Dragon is out of here. So let's move on, that's all the beat em ups done. Let's go over to Samurai Aces. So let me just find the game of Samurai Aces. And we'll pop that in. Might have to adjust things a little bit because it's all over the shop. Whoa. Seems like RetroArch does not <laughs> like vert games at all. This is going to look fugly, but it'll have to do. It looks fugly on my screen as well. It's absolutely horrible, but I'm just going to deal with it for the time being. Oh my god, this is dreadful. Sorry, but it'll have to do. Playing a vert game this wide is just... <laughs> Some people play this all the time, like this. Why? Oh, I've accidentally used my special attack. Oh my god, this is this is awful. I I really do apologise for the uh, for the aspect ratio. This is disgusting. And this is how it actually looks like on my screen too. So um. Ugh. This is why I don't use RetroArch very often. Because the emulation's just pants for the most part. Oh my god, this is ugly. And difficult to use. And a wee bit laggy as well. But it's the only option I have, so uh, at the, for the time being, it'll have to do. going to be a dreadful score though. Beast, you miserable battle scum. Oh, this is... Yeah. Yeah, playing a vert game in, in this aspect is just disgusting. I really do apologise. I, if I had more time, I would have tested this, but I'm halfway through a recording a session where I'm just going through all the games I missed back to back. I can't kind of stop, pause and review and then uh, then swap aspects and whatnot. That's not the spirit of this video. We're just going in raw dogging it. Any technical issues, anything like that at all, we are just going to work through them and carry on. Good, bad or ugly gameplay, doesn't matter. We're getting through them. Definitely ugly gameplay. Not as ugly as the screen itself, but ugly. Ah! There's my first credit gone. Never actually played this game before. It's quite cool. Um, if it wasn't for the awful aspect ratio.
Do you think you can match me in a dogfight? Are off! Okay. Come here. Damn it! I've got to use my bombs more often. I say that every time I play a vert game. A shmup. I just, I just forget to use bombs. So that's the evil castle. I'll sink it. Bollocks. And there we go. Game over. That was rather pathetic, but it's the best I could do with this at the moment. That was awful. But it's off the list. So uh, there are just two left people. Three left, should I say. Three left. Samurai Aces is down for the count. But the next one is the King of Fighters 98. Standard, not ultimate match. Standard match. And Retro Arch decides to crash. Let's try that again. Let's try and get this game going. Crashes again. Good old retro arch. Okay, now it's working. All righty. Okay. So I may have to set my buttons up for this one. My phone's going. Okay, let's go. Getting as far as we can. Hopefully my buttons are set up properly. If not, we will soon find out. I'm gonna go advanced and I'm gonna go Rugal. And then I'm going to go Yori, and then I'm going to go Terry. They're my badass boys. Nope, my buttons are completely off. Shit. Alright, I'm just going to have to make do. With a second left on the clock. Or well, no seconds left on the clock. Right, okay. It's not the start I wanted, though. Okay. 
Okay, that's a bit better. Okay. He's out the way. There's no value to a broken toy, which is what you losers are. Nice. Let's go. Gotcha. What I'm trying to do is is got like a, a dragon punch kick for lack of a better word, but I can't figure it out. I can't remember how it's done. But you can link that into his grab. And it's a really powerful combination, but I've forgotten how you do it. There we go. Now if you time that right. You can kind of hook in your grab after it. Ah. Okay, onto your Ori. Tell me I lose it all here. That would suck. Okay, it's all on Terry. Okay, let's do it. That's cheap, but it works. Bam, 
Gotcha, bitch. against the uh, Freddy Krueger looking fella. Joy! down to Terry which was also my dad's name by the way may he rest in peace quick for me. Oh. And there we go, there's end of the first credit. Okay. Yeah, we're going to continue. Gauge will start at maximum. We're gonna go with uh, extra mode this time. We're gonna stick with uh, the same team. Because to be quite honest with you, I don't really know the moves for anybody else. So. These are my go-to guys. I know a couple of other characters, but these are my favorites. forgotten how you use the gauge which means I may have made a mistake here went through my kick. The, the move preference. Shit. 
shouldn't have done it twice in a row. Okay. good stead. Although we are against Kim, so... Higashi. Look at it out. Yori's got f faster projectiles than Joe. Might be a bit of an ear rape, but it works. Oh, now I'm in the corner. Not good. Especially not against Andy Bogart. Yeah, that works. It may be cheap, it may not be fancy, but it works. So it's, it's all good. Okay, let's go. Japan. Lady, 
It never looks like they're actually touching the floor on this level. Is me just about dead? Ah. Zig wanna shut his act. Dodging each other, keep missing. Ugh. Okay, now I'm on the back foot. This is where it's all going to end horribly. So Robert's got full health, I don't. This is going to be tricky. me out <clears throat> so there we go what was that round five round four something like that four or five I can't remember exactly it's now 1 a.m. my mind is starting to flag as on my eyes Whew. yeah that ain't beautiful but it matters not beauty doesn't matter when there's a score on the line and speaking of score let's move on to the next one and that is Metal Slug X. So let's get Metal Slug X rolling. And Retro Arch is getting going again. Cool, cool, cool. It's actually working right off the bat, which is great. Now we're going to go as Marco. Although there's no real difference between them. Mission one, start. Heavy machine gun. Thank you. Heavy machine gun. I love the animation of Metal Slug. Just incredible. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. 
my metal camel. I can't believe I've died already. Doing terribly. Normally, I can clear the first level, well, first two levels without dying, but it's late and I'm doing horrifically. Didn't even save the guys out there. Yes, this is not going well.
Ugh, damn. Fell off the edge. That's not good. Approaching the boss. Heavy, heavy machine gun. Oh no, I jumped out my fucking truck. And there we go. I'm doing terribly tonight. Level 3 of Metal Slug X. As I said, normally I can do the first level without losing a life, get to the end of the second boss without losing a life, and then, you know, carry on from there, but it's just not working for me tonight. So we're on to the final game to catch us up, and it's a classic. It's an absolute classic. That got a movie, strangely enough, uh, with The Rock, Dwayne Johnson. And the movie wasn't too bad. Okay, it didn't really stick to the plot of the game too much, but I think it worked better because of that. It is Rampage! Let's go. Getting as far as we can with our little buddy here, George. The idea is to smash 
as many buildings as we possibly can. It starts off easy. Oh. Ooh. Buildings are gonna. The ruler gonna. Next level. Taking damage is pretty much unavoidable, there's so much of it, you've just got to try and mitigate as much as you can by getting power-ups and things, I mean, you're not going to last forever in this game, but you just got to get through as far as you can. Of course, if you get the bucks and babes like that one, it certainly helps. And if you fall off the building, that certainly doesn't help. That's my first credit gone. I did add a coin, right? Oh, well, I'll add another one so that I can carry on. I'm not going to get far anyway. I'm uh, getting pretty tired now. It's, it's 1 a.m. I've been playing for what? Just over an hour at this point. Multiple arcade games. After a long week at a new job, I'm kind of tired. But let's see how far we can get anyway. I got hit so hard, I got pushed into the other side of the screen. Ow. Come back. Yeah. Kalamazoo. I'm gonna eat you.
And that's game over. Kalamazoo was the end of me. And I run off bollock naked into the abyss. And there we are. Game over. So, um, yeah, on the whole, bit of a mixed bag, really. I don't think I did particularly well in any of the games, but that's the way it goes. Chaka! Yeah, so, uh, yeah, I don't think it went brilliantly. Um, anyway, only the Punish accounts for this week's Retro Tech Manandra Facebook pages 20 PRK Challenge. The rest, they've already been and gone. I, I just wanted to catch up, you know, and do them. Um, I don't think they're winning runs, any of them, to, to be honest. So even if I was doing competition back on the actual week where it was that game, I don't think any of my runs tonight would have won, including the Punisher one for this week. But they're all done now. We're up to speed. We're going to try and keep up with this every week going forward now that I'm a bit more settled in my in my path in my job because my job I have to get up a lot earlier than I used to so there's a whole routine shift and my son going to school that that affects that and yeah there's there's just been a whole load of stuff where I haven't really been able to have the time to play retro games but there we go this weekend we have made up for lost time we have caught up with one two three four five six seven games all in one video I hope you enjoyed it hope you play with me and I hope you enjoy retro gaming. Until next time, boy. <laughs>